Hello everyone, this is Sidekick Jason here for another audio commentary of Season 2. Today we'll be discussing Episode 32, Old and Wise. Um, I'm really excited for you guys to see this episode. This is the first episode of HD quality narrow gauge engines um, stuff that I filmed. It's just, I, I'm super excited for you guys to be able to see this. I put a lot of hard work and effort into these episodes that are the, the narrow gauge ones, making sure they're the highest quality I can give you guys. Um, you'll notice already the animation in their faces. Um, I added, between season one and two, I, I got the idea to add the um, blinking animation. That was from Diesel D199. He was kind enough to explain to me kind of the process of how you do it, and so I was able to incorporate it into um, my series. And it looks really nice, as you can tell, just a little extra effect to bring life to the engines. Um, so today's episode, um, just another episode of Season 4, well, Season 4 of the TV series is what I try to make it like. You've got um, the, the narrow gauge engine shed, the way you find it in Season 4, not how you find it later in the TV series, um, but just... There in the little ga narrow gauge engines are chatting and having another, just another day there. Um, I was really sad in the TV series that they kind of, that they took away that film set and that they, they've made the narrow gauge engines more in the mountains. And I kind of liked having them right next with, next to the standard gauge engines and having them, um, then as they traveled up the line, went to the to the mountains, and so I wanted to bring that set back, and that way that you can have more of that interaction between the standard gauge engines and the narrow gauge engines. So, right now in the episode, what's going on is with Rusty. Um, Rusty was sent up to help because Duke had had trouble getting up the hill, and Reneus tried to help get push him up the hill, but derailed the brake van, and so Rusty had to come. Um, this episode. Kind of got the idea from Super Rescue, um, the railway series um, story, and wanted to incorporate something where Scarloe got to prove to be heroic by having his own Super Rescue. And so this is kind of a, uh, the, the plot that I came up with where um, Scarloe gets to come and help and rescue three engines at once. Um, yeah, so that's kind of what's going on right now. Like, there's the blinking animation again that I love so much. Um, I hope you guys can like recognize the specific um, scenes like and re recognize their season four counterparts from the TV series. Um, I hope I did well enough replicating them that it, that they're easily recognizable like that that scene where the, that aerial shot where Scarlowe is coming down the line I hope you guys can recognize that from the TV series um, here we've got Glenock station um, I don't believe it's actually called Glenock anymore um, when I was in the process of um, scripting and filming the these episodes this was about two years ago that I was doing it two two or three years ago when I was scripting them and that station was called Glenock from what I was able to um, research and find out about it but since then I believe that there's been an official um, island of Sodor map that's come out that has said that that station is actually not called Glenock so I, it's too late for me now so I guess I'll just keep referring to it as Glenock. Um, and yeah, so here now we've got the viaduct. Um, it's a giant, massive foam creation, and I love it. It looks amazing um, with the engines going over it. Um, that one was a, a long process to to put together, but it turned out really nicely. It was kind of a pain because it's taller than my actual set, and so I had to um, add more sky background to it. Um, and here we've got Proven's Gate Station, another Season 4 set that I replicated and brought back. Um, I hope I did a good job with this one. It's been kind of fun because you can have the standard gauge engines move around in the background just like how it was in the Season 4 of the TV series. Um, so yeah, now we're getting close to the conclusion of the episode. Sir Top and Hat came to congratulate Scarlowe and thank him for his hard work. Um, this is just a, a good episode with Scar Lowy as the the focus and being able to help out with the other engines. Um, kind of fun. You get to see Peter Sam here at the end congratulate him, whereas at the beginning Peter Sam was one of the ones that was making fun of Scar Lowy. So, kind of a just just a good episode in my opinion. So, 
Well, that's it for today. Um, hope you'll follow Ben's advice here and go and subscribe and check out our news blog and all the other fun links we've got there. So we'll see you next time and have a good time. Clicking the visit channel button. If you want to learn more about the up and coming latest adventures from Sodor and to find out about the latest updates, then click the news blog button. You can also check out the Google Plus and our Facebook page by clicking a link in the description. We hope to see you again soon. Come back often for more videos.